Welcome. In this video, you will see Vertica and ClickSense BI tool working together to provide you with insights into your big data. Vertica is a high performance SQL analytics engine available on premise, in the cloud, or on Hadoop. ClickSense is an intuitive self service visualization tool. Free versions of each product are available from their respective companies. Now we'll show you an interactive ClickSense dashboard running on an Vertica database with over 1 trillion rows. We'll give you an explanation of how it works on the ClickSense side using direct discovery. And we'll give you an explanation of how it works on the Vertica side using live aggregate projections. We'll start by launching ClickSense. and we'll launch the application. Let's open up the executive dashboard. So as you can see, there are a little over 1 trillion rows being reported on here. Let's only do purchases because purchases and returns will negate each other. And let's look only at the two most recent years. So as you can see, it only takes two or three seconds for all the charts to refresh. We've filtered it down to only 411 billion rows. We can click on some other filters here. Let's see, warehouse locations, we'll pick um, south. Three or four seconds. Everything refreshes. Let's clear the warehouse region and pick a call center region. Pretty quick. Um, I can also do the those filters right on the charts themselves if I want to um, do call centers in the northwest. I can just click there. If I want to limit it only to medical products, just click on the medical bar on that. Everything refreshes quickly. Now, we started before by clicking on purchases. And then the two most recent years, watch how fast it takes the second time. Now it's instant. Now it's gone from two or three seconds to under one second. And the reason is because the first time we went through everything, it was using direct discovery to hit Vertica and get the results back very quickly, a few seconds. But the second time it was cached by ClickSense. And so it comes back almost instantly. So your choices are really, really fast or even faster. You can adjust the expiration time of the cache if you want to always have up to the second real-time information being reported on when you click on these filters. Okay, so you may be wondering at this point, how did we get these kind of speeds on this volume of data? Well, on the click side, we use something called direct discovery. Now, just direct discovery is handled in the uh, loading syntax. Let me bring that up. Okay, so if you look here, you'll see that we're using a syntax based on direct query. So the Kix engine supports this now for both ClickView and ClickSense. And what it does is it allows you to push the processing down to the database. So it would be difficult to bring a trillion rows of data into memory, which is what click products do by default. However, it would take mm, 25 to 100 terabytes of memory to hold this one fact table. And it would take a long time, probably days if not weeks, to load that data into memory each time you wanted to use it. So instead, we Click will push the queries directly down to Vertica. 
in the direct query syntax, it looks sort of like a, a SQL select statement, except that you specify which columns are dimensions, measures, detail, which I don't have any in this example, and detach. So in this case, this is the table, online sales FSH2, um, where the data is coming from. The dimensions are also loaded in this script. The first thing we should do is load the database. We'll go into the data load editor. And we'll click load data. Now the data is being loaded up. The main fact table, which is the online sales table from the VMart database, has one trillion rows. It is also loading up several dimensions, some of which are large. There are over 60,000 products in the product dimension table, and there are 5 million customers in the customer table. OK, it took 2 minutes and 23 seconds. Now, the reason it was able to do that so quickly was because it didn't actually load the trillion rows of data. It only loaded the dimension data into memory. And for the trillion row fact table, it loaded just metadata about that table, the column names, the column types, that sort of a thing. This enables Click to generate the appropriate SQL to push down to the Vertica database. Okay, so now the queries are being pushed down to the database. How does Vertica respond to those queries so quickly? One of the main ways that we got Vertica to respond so quickly with results to queries on this trillion row table was to take advantage of something called live aggregate projections. Vertica is a columnar database and it stores its data in projections. So a table, in Vertica is only a logical construct. The data is actually stored in projections. You can make several projections for a table in different sort orders with different subsets of the columns. That's normally how you do it. In this case, we used a special type of projection called live aggregate projection, which does all the calculations of the sums and counts that we want for the measures that we want, and it does it at load time. So it doesn't need to do it at query time. It's already sort of pre-calculated. Let's take a look at these projections. Here I'm using a database browser tool called DB Visualizer to take a look at these projections. So let's look at the list of tables. Here is the table that is the trillion row fact table. And there are several projections. Every vertical table always has a super projection that contains all the rows and all the columns. These other projections are optional. In this case, these are all live aggregate projections. And let's take a look at one. Okay, so this one, which is called Online Sales FH2 Shallow, has a subset of the columns from the fact table. This is the subset of columns. And for every combination of unique values of those columns, we have calculated the sum and the count of a measure called sales dollar amount. So on the dashboard, if you hit, if you use filters that are these or a subset of these columns to get sums or counts of sales dollar amount, it will come back extremely fast. So now you've seen an interactive ClickSense dashboard running on Vertica with over 1 trillion rows. You've seen how it works on the ClickSense side using direct discovery, and you've seen how it works on the Vertica side using live aggregate projections. We hope you found this informative. If you are interested in trying out Vertica, you can download the Vertica Community Edition by following these links. Thank you for watching this video.